Hey everyone, this is Chanyot66, and this is the unboxing without the box of the My Fly Dream Autopilot. This is one of the first autopilots that has vibration dampening built in, so you don't have to worry about mounting it anywhere. The uh, accelerometers and gyros and uh, pretty much everything that's inside here, because it has multiple different sensors, is vibration dampened inside the case so you don't have to worry about anything that you're doing how to mount it how to try and build some strange contraption like you do with the RVO it's OSD version 1 through 6 so it's really nice that they did think of that and it's one thing that most other autopilots and flight controller systems don't think about um, so everything below here comes in the box this is the autopilot you have the GPS for it. You have a pigtail for the power into the FPV system. So this would be a 12 volt connection. You have two different transmitter connections here. This one is for the Fat Shark, Immersion RC, or Hobby King transmitters. So it'll actually connect into any of those. Mo pretty much any of your 5.8 uh, gigahertz transmitters use these same connectors. There's a few out there that are different, but the majority use these same ones. You may just have to check your pin on these to make sure that your video and audio line up correctly because uh, Hobby King and Fat Shark use different pinouts. That also comes with a cable to connect your uh, 2.4 or 1.3, 1.2 gigahertz video transmitters uh, that use the 4 pin connector comes with those. comes with a raw cable to be able to connect your flight camera. So anything that uses these micro connectors uh, like the PZ0420 and any of the Sony Superhead cameras um, this can be pinned out directly to it. It comes with the end so all you have to do is plug it in in the correct order to match your camera and you're good. Um, the jumper I don't believe is used anymore uh, but I will check on that again later and let you know what that is for. It also comes with the USB adapter so just in case you need to program anything, do any firmware updates any of that, it comes with it. You don't need this at all to set up the autopilot. It's one of the only autopilots that you set up completely from your remote. You don't need it for anything. You want to set up return to home you don't need it. You can change all your flight modes configurations, rates, everything just from your remote. It also comes with one thing that most systems overlook is the interconnect cables from your receiver to the flight controller. Uh, the only time you'll see ones like this is if it's a specialized cable like uh, some of the flight controllers uh, come with a specialized cable that combines them all into one. This one they give you all six for six independent channels and you can strip them down to how you'd like. Uh, I'll show a couple different ways of stripping this down in the next video. It also comes with a current sensor, which you put your connectors on that you'd like. Uh, later I'll show mine with XT60s on it. And they include the shrink tube to go over it. So once you're done putting your connectors on, you can shrink this all down. And if you wanted to go a step further, you could actually seal around this. So use some epoxy and fill in uh, and shrink this down onto all of it and it'll make it waterproof. The last thing here is the GPS and it's a Locusis uh, GPS used by most flight controllers now. It's very precise, has a 10 hertz refresh rate and is very powerful. I can get a signal indoors and not have any problems. All of the wiring, if you haven't noticed, is shielded so everything about it is extremely nice. They thought about every aspect of FPV and how all of your video wires and common wires that pick up noise and have problems are all shielded. So if you uh, check back soon I'll have the next video which is going to be a basic configuration and how to plug all the wires in and then after that I'll be continuing on to a few videos on setup, configuration, and installing it on a few different aircraft. So check back soon for more videos. Chan Yote, out.